Assistant Morgan's back. Hi. <laughs> He did a little Botox here. You can get a big old cactus. Eh, 2018. Yeah, that's fine. Nobody fully can be trusted because it's business. I don't know guys, should I keep vlogging or should I go back to like try on hauls and stuff? Yes, <laughs> yep. Hey, okay. we could hide. No, 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 Lexi, I don't think these are for sale. <laughs> They're not? No. Okay. Hey guys, welcome back to the weekly vlogs. Today I am on my way to Michelle Marie PR because this is so exciting. Jamie, you guys know Jamie, my best friend Jamie. She's on a TV show and the show's premiere is happening next week and she invited me to be her plus one. So we're going to look for outfits for the premiere and also just for new clothes in general. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna find my premiere look there, but I already like have some ideas in mind for active wear and other things that I want there. So let's go shopping. I'm meeting Jamie's friend Brittany for the first time at a showroom. So like, this is Brittany. It's me. Brittany's an actress. Right? And the comedian. Which also, comedian. you both so do stand up comedy. Yeah. I love that we always talk about that. We do have to talk about that a lot. Yeah. We have a lot to say. Um, but we're going to go pick out clothes. One minute, 37 seconds later. All the things that you can be. secured the bag. I'll do a little try and haul when I get home, but I also just went to Starbucks. And I didn't vlog it because I had too much in my hands, but I got three perfect bars and a hot coffee. Even though it's like 95 degrees out right now, everybody like likes the ice noise, but I prefer hot drinks. I'm very excited though. Actually, I'm just gonna show you now, whatever. I got this really cute bag. Look at how cute this is. I love the thick strap. I don't even know what brand it is. I just saw it and I was like, yeah. So yeah, I'll show you guys like the rest of the stuff when I get home though. I'm sweating. So Morgan is on her way back from San Diego right now too. And um, we're going to go to the plant store today, I think. And we're going to try and finish up some art projects because she leaves town again tomorrow to go to a concert. And then she goes home for the week to pick up her dog. I'm so excited to be living with Stassi soon. She's so funny, you guys. Anywho, I'm gonna start driving back to the apartment and I'm gonna turn you guys off because I don't wanna crash my new car. And like, if you saw the last vlog, you would know that that almost happened. Flashback. It's literally going 40 miles per hour on the highway. It's fine. <laughs> Where the, oh my God. End of flashback. See you at home. I'm sweating. Okay, let me show you real quick what I got. Okay, I already showed you guys this cute little purse, but like, how stunning. I'm obsessed. M-A-N-C is the brand. I just got this because I like sweatshirts. I like sweatshirts. Please be a decent effing human. So I'm trying not to wear sweats every day because I feel like it does change how I like carry myself throughout the day and stuff. So I'm going for active wear now. Like I'm stepping it up, even though I'm not gonna work out that much or like ever. So I got these IVL Collective. It's not any orange activewear set. It has ruffles around the band, how cute. Matching top also has ruffles, so cute. Like I love the little detail. And then I just really like this color. So I got a top, like it looks like a little crop top. And then I got the matching tennis skirt with it. But then I also got these little shorts. Oh, oh, I'm not done. This is my favorite one. This is my favorite one. So cool. I love a good bomber jacket, like these vintage looking ones. I don't know if this is vintage, but I love like the colors are me. Like the colors are perfect. Usually these jackets are like bright orange, red, neon yellow, or like brown and stuff. These are my colors though. So I was like, I need this. Okay, bye. <laughs> Assistant Morgan's back. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Recap them on your life. Here you go. Oh, they're be way better today. Oh my God. That's not mm -hmm. cool. well, it's Wait, should we go soon? We should go now. Yeah. Okay. Am I driving? Yeah. Okay. Didn't turn on the camera, but Morgan spilled on herself. It was way worse than the photo look, but she spilled on herself, then we cleaned up the car, and now we're parking and heading into the plant shop to go do grandma things. Yay! Yay! Grandma! That's style. It's gonna be really that. expensive though. Yeah, it's 200. You can get a big old cactus. Eh, 2018. Yeah, that's fine. I'm just gonna suggest things as we go. This is my favorite tree ever. This is ficus Audrey, or Audrey ficus, I don't know which one. Cute. This is overwhelming, so I wanna find English ivy. Okay. Where? Let's just How? look around for this. <gasps> yeah. More snake plants for breathing Do you need air. more? No, I don't. I definitely don't need more. Did you ever get a rubber plant? Hey, okay. we could hide. No, 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 Lexi, I don't think these are for sale. <laughs> They're not? No. Okay. Hey, is that a big rubber plant? 
Where? Oh my god, it is. Let's go. Okay, let's Ooh, go like flowers. this. flowers. No, these are all fake. Please, can we not do that? <laughs> oh my god, look at this chandelier thing. You will love it. Oh my god. Okay, we're wasting time, though. <laughs> <laughs> we suck. This way. Here's ivy, but this is variegated. Mm, we talked about these, the pothos. Yes, I like these a oh, lot. I think it's pothos. Um, sure. Don't call me on that. I love that. Yeah, I like that one. It's cute. I think that one's the How same as that one. one. English ivy does grow fast, but I don't think they have any. I don't see any. I also love these ones. Excuse me? Yeah. Um, do you guys have English ivy? Oh my god, those mm -hmm. are so cute. Yeah. There's this the nickel. I love that. Yeah. There's a bunch. Yeah. I really like bunch. this. This is pretty. Oh yeah, take that one, Lex. Just take it. Let's get the cart. Yeah. We'll grab that and we'll get the cart. I don't see them. What do they look like? Like literally like pearls, like little green oh, pearls. Cute. It's like jewelry. It's so pretty. Wait, wait. Let's ask her to take us there. Yeah, because that's important. Maybe we could just put this at the front if they don't have a cart. We could start mm -hmm. putting the ones that we want. Yeah, we'll just keep making our way up there. Perfect, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yay, bringing them home. So excited. He was carrying it. He was definitely carrying it. Yep. Well, he did it by himself. Incredible. Oh my god, it looks like you're carrying a Christmas tree up. You're like the Grinch. Good job. Yep. One minute, 37 seconds later. That is what we're trying to hide. That ugliness that we look at every morning is what we bought this plant for. Okay, I just set up all the plants in one room. So I think it might be a little too much, but you guys let me know what you think. But um, yeah, I think it might be too much, but like I kind of like it. So those would obviously be hung up, maybe like above the bed. It's 10 p.m. I forgot to eat dinner and lunch and breakfast today. So it's time to eat a bagel. Okay. You guys get the point. Hello, good morning. Not much is happening today. I just have one thing that I wanted to bring you guys along to. I'm going to Dr. Dimitri to get Botox and filler because he comes in town like twice a year now. And so that's just when I go and do my beauty things. Since my lips will be all swollen and stuff the rest of the day, I'm just gonna be editing. I'll show you guys how the appointment goes. I'll show you after the appointment <laughs> what it looks like. And then, um, yeah, that's basically it for today. But the rest of this week will be very exciting. So, okay, see you at Dr. D. I'm a little swollen. I didn't really get any videos in there because I didn't have anybody to videotape it and like there was no doctor's assistant in there. So I tried. <laughs> For like a half a second and then it was just kind of like weird and distracting i put it away because i wanted it to turn out good and like not have any issues so um yeah this is my face after honestly the only thing that looks different is my lips look a little bit bigger um but it's swollen right now so it's gonna go down even i love the color after getting them done though because it's like all the blood this is kind of gross all the blood rushes so it's like it makes it pinker he did a little botox here and he said that'll set in by a week or this weekend so i'll keep you guys updated and we'll keep doing my forehead movements every day and see what happens there is one more thing that i wanted to do um before i turn you guys off and like edit and just go at my the rest of the day so let's go upstairs because i do have a little home project to do real quick okay in the bedroom now and i'm gonna put curtains up one thing that i learned from my mom the higher up that the curtains go on the ceiling the taller the room looks so even if the window ends before the ceiling, if you put the curtains there, it just makes it look shorter. I tried to put it as high up as possible. I don't know if you guys can see. And then I tried to spread it out as much as possible too. I couldn't put it all the way to the end because there's that like little dip in the ceiling, but hopefully this will look like floor to ceiling windows that are just like halfway closed or something. That That's the goal. So um yeah i'm excited to see how it looks two thousand years later hi it's been like four days i'm so sorry you guys forgot to turn you on basically what happened was at dr dimitri's office i got a bruise here and it kind of looks like a black eye and i just got embarrassed about it so i like stopped video but i'm over it now i'm gonna go thrifting with jamie at the Melrose trading post this is what i'm wearing pack sun i'm trying to decide on a bag waiting for tiktok to tell me so yeah let's go thrifting
Okay. Why? Because it's annoying. <laughs> I don't know, guys. Should I keep vlogging or should I go back to like try on hauls and stuff? I don't think realistically I'll be able to do both. And like 90% of you guys on Instagram said you'd rather see try on hauls. So I'm like, why won't you guys watch the vlogs? Okay. Dude, I'm done with my that, pancake. I'm like... going to finish my pancake. Can okay. you chill? Sorry. Okay. Alright, I'm going to eat my pancake. Because it's pancake Sunday. It only really makes sense. Good. When I'm done eating, though, I'm gonna show you guys what I got. Show and tell. Change into sweatpants because low rise pants are so hard to bend over in. Alex got lots of sunglasses. He got these. These are his normal boy sunglasses. I think this is a good purchase. I think he needed to buy something normal looking. Okay, so I went up to this stand. You guys know I love my cute mugs. Or maybe you don't, but if you follow me on Instagram, you know I love my cute mugs. And I was like, excuse me, do you guys have an online store? Because I want to buy all of these, but I can't right now. And she's like, oh my gosh. Like, I think I uh, follow you on Instagram. And then she gifted me this cute little mug set. I'm obsessed with it. Like, it's going to be so cute in our kitchen. I'm just, I'm really excited about this one. I for sure would have bought it on my own too. I might buy a set of four. I don't know. It's perfect. It's everything. Honestly, we didn't get anything else because I need to like spend years just making decisions like I almost got all those prints and then Alex was like no and then I got like in my head and I was like I can't do this right now so then I had to leave um also wanted to show you guys I want to show you guys an update on the Botox I'm not gonna say names because I don't want to like throw anybody under the bus I don't know I just feel like I feel bad oh uh, the point of this story is just because you've been going to somebody for years for whether it's nails, hair, whatever, doesn't mean you should just like blindly trust them. Doesn't and mean that they can't fuck you over. Okay. Basically, I have been going to this doctor since I moved to LA like a long time ago. Um, and we've always just kind of done the same stuff. He stopped telling me the amount that he was putting in of each thing because I just trusted him so much. I was like, just make me look good, make me look natural. Like, I don't want to like, you know, look crazy or anything. Just like wherever you think I need a little bit of like a refreshed look or touch up or something. He's like, got it, I got you. Basically, the point is always make sure that you're getting charged the correct amount and never tell a doctor your budget because I did that and then they overcharged me completely for something that should have been half the amount and I have no way of proving it and so now I can't get my money back. So basically I texted him saying, hey, are you sure? Because it really just doesn't feel like you put four syringes of filler. That's a lot of filler, you guys. Like, there's no way. And I've never gotten that before and I, I feel like I, my face would have felt different, you know? I was like, I, I really don't think so and the girl at the front desk said you used two syringes and he goes oh um no she was talking about per side and i'm like per side of my face like who would who would say it that way like that it's never been communicated oh no no, no we're talking about in half so like multiply it by two like no then i was like um can you just double check because i kind of feel like i got taken advantage of because i did share my budget with you and it's never been this much before he came back more defensive and I just kind of quit trying to be hurt there, but I don't know. It was just like a crappy experience. But my point is I want to tell you guys this because I feel like I learned the hard way of just like over trusting the doctor. If you get Botox or filler and you think they have your back, nobody fully can be trusted because it's business and everybody's just trying to get money. So, yeah. Learning experience. Stasi's here. You guys get to meet Stassi. I'm trying to get her to go pop. <gasps> oh you want to go say hi? Hi! She might be on the floor. Hi! It's okay, we don't have time today. Hi! Oh my gosh, welcome home! Oh my god, wait, she's gorgeous. She didn't even go pop. Her, her, oh my hair god, touch. her hair is so nice. 